Hello everyone, welcome to Solar Life. Today it is a very gray day outside as you can see and I'm gonna do an experiment with my solar array because when I built it, one of the things I wanted to be able to do was to adjust it whenever I had a gray day or a overcast day or in this case, a day where it's not going to snow, but I'm not getting a lot of power, and I'll get more power out of the solar panels if they're tipped up towards the clouds and not at their uh, orientation that they have right now. So that's what I'm going to do here. I'm going to take the solar panels and I'm going to tip them out flat so that they're horizontal to the ground and I'm going to make sure that they're, they're as level as they can be and uh, we're going to see if the power increases or decreases by doing this. So now that the panels are tipped out flat, they're producing more power than they were when they were tipped up towards the, uh, the, the angle of the sun previously which was the way they had to be in order to shed the snow and the rain and the, and the ice and stuff. But on a day like today where it's not going to snow, it's not going to rain, I'm not going to get any freezing rain, I'm safe to tip the panels back up towards the, uh, the horizon and get more light out of all the clouds. And so it's pretty interesting that we're now making probably 30 or 40 percent more power by tipping the panels back. So this is a pretty good case for having uh, solar trackers and things like that on your panels uh, but in my case I don't want them automated I want them to be able to be under my control so that they don't uh, inadvertently tip and flatten themselves out and then get covered in snow so this way uh, I can adjust the direction of the solar panels by hand from the house uh, at the touch of a button and then uh, when I need to I can tip them back up straight so that they'll shed the snow uh, in the middle of a snowstorm.